Um, tell a joke. <laughs> Girl, are you breaking down in front of this guy? Come on. Shalom, shalom, shalom. Hope everybody's good. Hope everybody's blessed. Hope everybody's nicely dressed. If you are new to my channel, if you could subscribe, that'd be nice. Because I'm pretty sure you're going to like my videos. And if you're not new to my channel, welcome back. Leah is now a young adult. Last episode, we had her age up. Um, She had all A's or whatever. And we had her age up. Now she has her own place. I built it from scratch because she really couldn't afford to do anything else. I couldn't get a house from the gallery because it would have been too expensive, I already know. So this is what she has right now. It's not the best, but it's what we could do. So I have a couple of goals for Leah as you watch her wash dishes. So one of my goals is she needs a new job. I forgot where she worked originally or if she's still working there. She's a sales floor clerk. She's only making 40, $40 an hour. In real life, that would be a lot of money, but in here, that's not enough, I don't think. Oh, I mean, it's a good amount, but at the same time, she's only, actually, it's an okay amount. Anyways, I want to get her another job to see if there's other jobs that, um, it's probably not going to cater to her, to her goal or her aspiration, but I still want her to find a better job. So for one second, I had to pause because my door is not locking at the moment. So it's like opening and he can now push. This is Rocco. Sorry, this is not his, uh, this is not his episode, but this is Rocco. Say hi, Rocco. Anyways. Yeah. So he just kind of pushed the door open. So I'm going to kick him out real fast. I need her to find some type of love so they can get married, so they can have the first baby. And I think I need to do that all in this one episode. I think I want to try to do it. So those are my goals. But first, right now. Our first goal is to change this outfit. So yeah, definitely. This is not where it's at. First of all, I'm the modest simmer. So we're going to have to create a, I don't know if I gave her this outfit or should they gave it to her, but anyways, I want to kind of change the hair. We want her to be, have, we want her to wear modest clothes and we want it to look nice. So let's just go to texture. Her hair is afro textured. The braids are cute, but it seems like, or these are uh, dreadlocks. They just seem, I don't know, I don't like them that much. See these ones? Pretty much the same thing. These are cute. Okay, so she still has locks, but wow, she's really pretty. Okay, so she still has locks, but we are going to, we just shortened them and changed them up a little bit. So as far as this outfit goes, this is cute. It's a little short. I'm even gonna lie. It's a little short. What if I dressed her up in like some of the clothes that she likes? Like her aspiration is to be like a privateer or something like that. If I dress her up like that, nah. That's cute, but I feel like Eve is wearing something like that already. Let's see if we can find like a skirt combo or something like that. These be like too short though, but I like them. I just wish they were longer. Okay, so <clears throat> this is kind of short for me. It's above the knees, but I feel like if I put leggings to it, it might be a little bit better. Cause like I was saying, I want her to be dressed modestly. Let's see what this is like. Okay, no. Something simple and modest. That's pretty cool. And then definitely change these shoes. What if I had her in No. No. Anyways, I'm not gonna trouble y'all with watching her, me try to figure out her outfit. So I'll be back after I figure this outfit out and her outfits and I'll show you what I got. Okay, so um, I'm done with the clothes. So this is basically what I have. So this will be her everyday um and i'm not really proud of these these are they're like they're okay but you have to realize a lot of the stuff on sims like if it's super cute it's probably not super modest and if it's modest it's kind of like old looking i was trying to get a lot of things that are like below the knees or at least at the knees but couldn't really find a lot so this is her every day and i thought this was cute just by itself i thought this dress with the with the long sleeve shirt that's cute this is her every day 
her formal i changed the hairstyle so i was trying to make it seem like if she she could have like uh false locks underneath her actual locks i know i just wanted to change the style up a little bit this is her athletic her nighttime i'm just gonna say something like she's anemic and she needs to be warm or something like that this is her party outfit it's a little it's above the knees but again a lot of these outfits if they're cute they're not modest um really they have some in here and maybe i didn't try as hard or look as hard but hey her swimwear her um hot weather and then we have her cold weather so we're basically done with her outfits that's out of the way so the next thing we need to do we need to focus on is i want to get her another job if she don't stop with these mood swings fall sadness hotline we're gonna have her do that first okay i had her call the hot, uh, the sadness hotline and hopefully she's still sad for another 24 hours can i have her call it again no stop playing a video game i need i need her to stop being so sad I mean, more time hours in two hours. She's back being sad. Okay, every single time I like, I call the hotline to try to lessen the time, and the time keeps changing. It keeps going from four hours to 19 hours. So I'm pretty sure this is how she's gonna be for a while. So <clears throat> the next thing on our list is to get her a job so while she's crying and while she's being sad and dramatic we're gonna go ahead and get her another job find a job so we have a couple of options for her select a career for leah so she can be making see this job is making this detective job is making less or well, she has the opportunity to get promotions so that's good Okay, let's see. Scientist, astronaut. Astronauts make a lot of money off the bat. Athlete, not enough. Business, okay. Uh, civil designer. Mmm. Asian, no. Criminal, no. Let's see. I'm thinking about that civil designer educator. Um. Let's go down the list. Freelance, law. I don't want it to be freelance. I want her to actually go into work every day military okay politician no what if i have her do the military how how much the first of all how much does the military make 54 and then the silver designer 57 so your girl is now a leah is now a civil designer she makes 57 an hour she goes to work every day except for uh what's it call it saturday and sunday that is her job yes it says work assignment acquire recycled materials should leah cho cho uh, chosen get a jump start and accept the assignment um mm, mm, do i want her to do that no we have to stick to the goals that we have. So, check off of that one. Girl, don't be sad. You quit a job for another, uh, for a better job. If you could have both, I would have had her keep both. So, next, it's a big jump, but Leah has to get married soon. Very, very soon. Um, So, what is this? No, that's a woman. Okay. Okay, so... Let's have her go out. Let's see. Let's have her go out somewhere. So Leah, dang it. Mm. Leah is fresh. She she's mm. looking for a husband that's mm. that's uh righteous will lead her to the most high. She's looking for a husband that's mm. taller than her. I don't know. We'll we'll see. We'll let's go out though. Let's travel somewhere. And let's go buy her. Who's this? Oh, that's a girl. Ugh. Anyways, let's go by ourselves. So, I'm trying to think, where's like a place? Let's go to San Machino. They have different like clubs and different karaoke bars. Um, let's go to let's go to this one. We having different events here. Okay, we're here. Let's see, is anybody here though? 
She doesn't have a lot of money, but I want her to come over here and buy some food. Um, maybe that'll cheer her up a little bit. What do they have? Let's order some food. So they have samosa. Samosa. Don't know how to pronounce that, so I'm not going to try. And curry. So let's get the most expensive one. Girl, get out of the... I need her to check. Monzo. So I know that he's married. This is Eric, I believe. Eric Lewis. Yep, he's married already. So we're not even going to try. And he looks like he's in a bad mood. Um. Oh, wait. Hold up. Hold up. Who's this? Oh, Bob Pink. Wait. Hold up. Girl. Get over here. Come, come. Do a friendly introduction. I know it's early. I know we ain't been out but two seconds. But I need her to meet people. She's all sad and stuff. Girl. Um, tell a joke. Girl. Are you breaking down in front of this guy? Come on. <laughs> Y'all just walking in between their conversation. Um, let's talk about the rain. Um, get to know a little bit. Have her. Okay, she a little loud in the back. But I guess we are at a karaoke, karaoke bar. So he's an art lover. Does she like art? I forgot. Does she like art? She oh she's painting she was she's been painting what's it called but it was kind of like a forced paint because I needed money for my but painting he likes art too um let's see acts about day um let uh who dude is he he over here blowing kisses to this guy anyways. Let's let's try to flirt a little bit. I guess she's too sad to flirt. Okay, let's spin this way so that we're not. Too bad. Dude, what are you? Wait, are they married or something? Wait a second. Hold on. I just need to see. I just need to see. I want to ask, just ask if he's like single or something. And she's too sad to do anything. That's frustrating. And it's just awful like mood swings. Ask is single. She's too sad. Okay, girl. Well, we got his number, so. And he's gone, anyways. So let's zoom out a little bit and let's go over here and get food. Or something. I don't know. What does she have? Let's see. Oh, she got produce? buy produce um no we want quick food right now sorry we're not in the business of cooking at the moment she's too sad to do anything oh shoot matter of fact you go ahead and play basketball let's do that um but i think you will want to get on the court before you start shooting let's let's shoot around dunk do a layup yeah let's see it come on yeah, girl. Let's 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 take out your frustration and do sports. First of all, she's pretty good to not have. To, oh, she only does one. Okay, maybe she just needs to be like around other people. Was this? I think this is Gavin. Oh, that's Dominique. Okay, who is this fan of one of these girls in here? Let's, is there any more karaoke places in here? Let's go in here. Watch karaoke, I guess. That'll make it better. I'm really upset that she's too sad to do anything. And this is just simply off of mood swings. It says, time to wear black from having a mood swing. Sad because I'm sad. You wouldn't understand. Nobody would understand. Girl, get out of here. You have a mission to complete right now. And it's cold outside and you got that on. You have a mission to complete. You got to get married in this episode. You have to maybe get pregnant in this episode. 
Let's do sing solo. Let's do pop and fun tonight. Cool. And then I just really want her. I want to do things that make her happy, man. Because <laughs> she's hungry and she is low on energy. So. Is he a vampire? No, this dude. This. Did, if y'all seen the earlier episodes, this dude walked into our our home and I think dazed Adam or Eve, one of the two. But it's like, why are you it? Anyways, let's go home, girl. Dang. So I'm gonna have her just go to sleep at this point. First of all. Let's turn up all, all these lights, auto lights, all these lights. And no, girl, you are not. You're going to go to sleep because I cannot deal with this unnecessary. I'm not saying it's unnecessary because people have emotions and da, 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 da. But you're having a mood swing that's been, that's, it's been all day. And are, is there more coming? Like, oh, let me quickly lock this door. Lock for, um... I don't know how do I like no trespassing disallow vampires cool yes yes it's eight in the morning and she is now happy time from living in a tiny home is that why I don't know when does she go to work she goes to work in three days so in that time when she needs to reach level three skill on logic and on uh handiness so I don't know if I want to buy her books for that or let's see I think I'm probably gonna mm. I just programming right web web let's see if we can have anything we'll teach her um she's probably just gonna order some books I don't know so we need some where are the skills skills and then we need some in they're kind of towards the bottom. Where's the logic ones at? What was that logic? Yes. So one, two, that's a lot of money. Okay. Let's not get the third one. Not right now. And then for handiness, I don't know if we passed it already. Is it in alphabetical order? Yeah, I think so. Cooking and gardening, guitar handiness. So we're going to get two of these so we spent a good deal we spent 450 that's not horrible but now she's but it's all it's all for her to get better um at her skills does interview a homeowner about utilities daily tasks um let's do that let's can I click on him? Visit the household, no one is home. Okay, can I talk to him? Let's see, let's see if I can talk to him. Let's do a friendly introduction. Girl, hurry up, he's across the street, hurry, hurry, hurry. And maybe we can interview him, we'll do that daily task and that'll be over. Maybe he's, I don't know if he's a homeowner. Are all these sims homeowners? So Okay, oh, brag about really tiny house now. Um, let's see. Complain about dish. Um, get to know enthusiasm. Get to know. Review about utilities. Cool, cool, cool. So it says Leah Chosen has identified that I don't care about fish. Why? Isn't too impressed by Leah's interview technique and questions. Leah gets told in no certain term that it is none of her business. None of their business. Let me see. So did it work? Oh, it's completed though. Okay, so that's all that matters, I guess. Is there a boy somewhere? Is that watching somewhere? 
Anyways, I don't care if he doesn't like the technique. Let's, so since she's in a happier mood, I want her to go out. So let's travel by ourselves. And she needs a homegirl or something like that. She needs somebody to like chill with. Um, where should I take her? Should I take her to like Oasis Springs? Hmm, Jim, I really want to go back to Sam and Shuno. Only because it just seems like there's a lot of stuff to do here. Why is it always oh. rainy over here? Do I know him? Yeah, we know of him. Right, let's, what's it called? Let's talk to her. No, not flirty introduction. I don't understand. Friendly introduction. I understand you're flirty right now, but is she not the one? Let's be friends with her. Uh-huh. Hey, um, let's mm, share photo photos. Why are you being mean right now? Um, oh, she's trying to be funny. Okay, I thought she was being mean. Let's say, girl, stop. Um, ask about her day. Who's this right here? I do not like that. How you just gonna come up in our conversation? You don't even know who we are. Let's tell a joke about ducks. Oh, since I have that dude's number, I'm going to see if I can ask him to come uh, here. No, He'll be right over. Cool. So cool, cool, cool. Huh. So I'm kind of have my head stuck. Uh, Wait, who, who's this? He looked like a teen. Though. Oh, no, this is Dominique, I think. Yeah, I don't know. Where is he? Is he over there? No. Okay, so I don't know who the guy is. No. No. Is he in here? Okay, so it's been about... I don't know. It's been about like an hour or two and he still ain't here. So your girl got stood up. So anyways, let's talk to somebody else. Let me see. How are you? You're a young adult. Let's do a introduction. And to see if he's married, cause the dude really just—I don't know if he's late or he's—he's he's just not here. He didn't—he didn't show up. <laughs> so, oh well, I don't care. Is he? Is it? Anyways, where'd he go? Oh, he's right here. Discuss interests with the guy. Let's ask about his day. I kind of want to get him away from here. Okay, let's ask about his love life. Get him away from everybody. Let's see, is he single? Did that ask? Is he, is, did that ask if he was single or not? I need to know if he's single or not. <laughs> okay, we're gonna flirt with him a little bit. Exchange numbers. This is the festival of snow has started. Uh, snow. Hold on. Snow sculptures and snow piles. Where is this at? Oh, not right now. That'd be fun, though. Wait, actually, let's go to the snow festival with Gavin. I'm excited. That'd be fun. Okay, so where's the festival going to be at? Okay, <clears throat> excuse me. The festival is going to be over here. Oh, well, the festival doesn't really happen until nighttime. So let's go ahead and order some food or something. Wait, who's that? Is that what's it called? Syria is here. Hold on, let's discuss our issues since moving out. Oh wait, hold on, where'd she go? Let's pause. She's moving too fast. Let's ask about day. <laughs> wow. 
Well, family reunion, is she here by herself? I saw her by her day. Um, bring up an embarrassing child moment. Secret handshake, okay. Make funny faces. And Gavin is just running around. Um, the romance festival's in town. Actually, forget this. Forget this. I don't want to be here. Let's go there. Hey. Okay. Okay, we're gonna go right now because the conversation is kind of taking too long. So, to the romance festival. So, we're here at the romance festival. So, let's see what shall we do first. And she is going someplace else. Away from your date. Even though it's not a date. It's not an official date. <clears throat> but we're dating. So. And she came to do karaoke. She's not good at singing <clears throat> whatsoever, but she came here to sing. <laughs> and then she's gonna she's gonna get embarrassed afterwards. <laughs> but uh is this what she really wants to do? That's not her aspiration. But her aspiration is like <laughs> play five rounds of Sabat. I don't know. She may not get her aspiration done, I ain't even gonna lie. That's not what we <laughs> I heard that throwing petals at the romance festival brings good luck. Want to find if it find out if it's true. Okay, um, I'm already here, mom. And two, I'm not going to the romance festival with you. Where is Gavin? Okay. Ax is single. And we haven't done that yet. What's it called? If he if I find out that like he's not single and he's like married, that's gonna be sad. Like I don't I'm not trying to waste my time here um with him if he's with someone else. Just sorry, no. Oh, this is cute. Wow, the lights are turning on over here. Okay, Gavin is neat. That's good. That's good in a husband. Let's see. Yes, he's single. Okay, so let's 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 let's, let's get to know him more. So let's do a bowl pickup line. Um, joke about getting together. Yeah, we'll joke. What else? Throw rose petals. Okay. Is that a preposterous rumor? No. Describe flirty dream with Gavin. Girl, what are you doing? Why are you denying him? Now you made him embarrassed. Okay. Maybe, maybe it's the fact that they're flirting, but they don't really know each other. So let's ask about day. No, 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 no. We can still do this, y'all. Ask about day again. Sorry. Let's not do that twice. Why do they why are they not ranking each other? Hold on. Okay, let's ask about career. Where are you going? Where are you going? No. We can still do this. Okay. Let's, let's um have a deep conversation. Fine, okay, cool. We we fixing it. Um let's discuss embarrassing mood. I don't know. Why are we embarrassed right now, y'all? Funny. Let's tell a joke. Una narca naps. Let's have a deep conversation. If this don't work, I, I could just go find somebody else. But I'm trying to make this work because he's here. I know that he's single. Um, we're the same age. Like, this could work. Um, Deep conversation? Okay. Let's go take a break. Let's take a break. We're here together at the at the festival and he's not leaving. So, so let's just... No. Let's buy food. Is this food? Let's get food. Let's order food. We're gonna get some... Probably some ramen. Pretty, pretty cheap. Let's get some food. Let's refresh. I really... Yeah, that was kind of embarrassing. I really need them to 
I don't need them to work out. I would just want them to work out. Okay, what if I asked him to join my household? Now, I know it's like weird, but it's like if I asked him to join my household, we can get to know each other some more. And we just say, oh, we're just roommates, you know. We're just the skinny dude. <laughs> we're just roommates, you know. Okay, let's do that. Cool. Oh, shoot. Is it a ch No, it's not a cheat. Okay, so he has 80... 88k and I have 900 something What if I took the majority of that money because look it's three people in that household so he could make that money back But right now I'm struggling So if he comes over to my household and I take a lot of that money, that's not cheating It's not so that's exactly what we're gonna do I don't know if I want to be that type of person and just leave the, the them a thousand but <clears throat> I'm gonna take the majority. They have 8,000 now, but I, <laughs> she has 80, I'm sorry. <clears throat> because it's, I didn't know I was gonna come up on this amount of money. We're gonna go ahead and check. So Gavin now lives with us, even though we're not together or anything like that. But we have eighty thousand dollars. I didn't know it. I'm. Is this the cheat? We're gonna go home. I don't care about this. Let's go home. We definitely need a bigger bed. You know what? I thought about it for a second. Instead of trying to do that, how about let's buy a whole new house? So we no longer have our tiny home, but. We came up on a new home, so I don't care. Cool. So, want them to go ahead and check out their new home. This is nice. We already have a kid's room here, just in case they have children. Even if this dude moves out, like, and he doesn't, like, want to be in a relationship with us because we're kind <clears> of <throat> grooming him to, to do that. Um, This is pretty cool. Let's go downstairs. Where are they? Wow, this place is nice. So we had, we, it was a rough time at the rom uh, romance festival. But right now we're doing pretty good. So I'm going to I'm gonna go for it. I hope this is not it's not too early. I hope they're like good friends to to where they're like Wow, yay. Cool. So cool. Let's ask to be boyfriend so that we know that we got him. Yay! Okay, cool, 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 cool. So, Gavin and Leah are... Wow. That's cute. So now that I know that I got him, I don't know. His appearance doesn't look so bad anymore. Not bad, but I don't know. Um, so they have time to spend together, get married, and hopefully make a baby. Go to sleep. Oh, it's snowing outside. So it is now winter. And by winter, she has already found her little boyfriend. Let's go downstairs. I don't know if she knows how to cook yet. No, nah, I don't think so. Like, decently, maybe. So I'm going to have her come downstairs and maybe cook. What's her skill level? Let's see. Uh, what's breakfast food? Macaroni and cheese. No, I'm just kidding. Um, let's do eggs and toast and let's do family size because we are developing a family. Um, do I want to do a wedding with them? I wasn't going to go all out and do that. That's their parents' house over here across the street. Um, I wasn't going to go all out and do a wedding, but should I do a wedding? That'll be cute. We're going to have a wedding, y'all. So I'm going to have Gavin and... Leah get married and have like an all out wedding. I wasn't going to do it because it's like I wasn't going to do it because we have other sims to attend to, but this is her episode. This is Leah's episode. So I'm going to do it. Where's Gavin? Gavin is upstairs. What's Gavin's job? He is a blogger. He makes how much he, he makes $32 an hour and he needs to just read books. Okay, cool. 
<laughs> um, he goes to work in three hours, so he's hungry. So I'm gonna have him come downstairs and have some. Okay, she reached cooking level two, so that's good for her. Don't know why she's standing and eating eggs, but. And then also she hasn't done, okay. So when he goes to work in three hours, I think I'm gonna have her work on her logic skills. And then I'm gonna have, afterwards, I'm gonna have him come home and propose to her. And then we start planning the wedding and stuff like that. And we can have a little winter wedding. That'll be cute. I still might change his outfit. Actually, I wanna do it right now. Okay, so this is what he looks like right now. And I'm gonna show y'all what he looks like when we get done with this. I'm done. So I didn't really show you guys, um, what his original outfits look like but i promise you it's a step up so this is his everyday this will be his formal this was already his formal and that's that was fine with me athletic i changed a little bit of it he's kind of scrawny um sleepwear i didn't change that one party i changed that one very simple very regular stuff but i just wanted to you know some of his clothes or his outfits was kind of like old looking see bones which is fine i just maybe we'll change mm -hmm. that um, later on that's his swimwear this is oh this is his hot weather and then we have his winter clothes so that's pretty much him this is what he'll be wearing on an everyday basis but at the moment since it is winter he'll be wearing this all right so when she gets done with that i'm probably gonna have her like i said work on her skills so that <laughs> by the time she wants to do her job thing she can ah. i'm gonna have her start off with the logic one book before he goes to work read a book read the first unicorn okay he goes to work in like four minutes he's not gonna have time to finish that that's fine actually go ahead and go to work gavin i want to have her work on her skills while you're gone um so she's skill level one with logic and she's almost in the middle i might want to go across the street and um visit her parents for a little bit see how they're living see if anybody aged up i don't know they live right over here so okay everybody's here did everybody just come back just oh my gosh heartfelt compliment let's brighten day i haven't seen them in like forever let's Oh. <laughs> oh, everybody's so <laughs> don't worry, we'll be we'll be back there the next video. But this is a heavy Aaliyah heavy video. Polino. Oh, <laughs> yes. Just as we left it. Wow. I don't know why I'm acting like this. We're probably gonna the next episode I'm probably gonna wanna focus on them more because Leah she's doing well for herself. They she she got Let's, um, she's gonna paint. Okay, let's see if I can. <clears throat> oh, Gavin's calling. Hey, Leah, it's me, Gavin. Do you want to go on a date? <laughs> this will be our first date. So, I'm gonna go ahead and go. Does anybody find it weird that he's at work, but he's also here with me on a date? Do I mind? I'm gonna have him work hard, but he's still here. That's strange. Okay, I don't care. <laughs> Anyways, maybe he's getting paid for this. So I was thinking if they did a wedding, this right here would be the perfect area to do the wedding at. I asked to propose. I want him to propose to her. And he currently cannot do that because he's at work. Let me see. Wait a second. Yes, he can. So is his work like... Can I, can I do that here? Wait, should I go to a pretty place? I'm gonna have them both come over here. In this area, over here. So it could be something cute. I don't know, something cute over here. Even though we don't do rings, being an Israelite, we're just gonna have them propose. They don't have to really wear a ring or nothing like that. I just, in order for them to be married, he has to propose, so. <clears throat> Pause. Hold on, this is nice. Wow. So they are now 
engaged oh, so they can start like planning the wedding uh, ah. go home girl uh -oh. for for he's not even supposed to be here uh -huh. technically it still says that he's at work so he needs to be at work but it's fine it's fine we're gonna we're just gonna go ahead and get out of here and uh and do that but this is cute i want to Mm. I want to see where I want to have the wedding. I know I was saying I want to have the wedding in that area. Actually, scratch that. We're going to have the wedding in that area. It's already set up and everything. We're going to have her come in here and cook dinner. It's like six. So let's cook. Well, she had ramen the other night, and I want her to like practice making that. So we're going to make ramen. I'm going to go ahead and invite some people over. This is just my family. Yes, my family. They get to go ahead and see my house. Oh, she just walked in. She just. That's a little strange. She's they're hugging weird. Oh, she's going upstairs, and I feel like she's gonna be at the computer. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if my assumption is correct. She likes it. She likes the way. Thank you, I bought this place. Okay, so she's just coming into my bedroom to paint. It's her skill, okay. Okay, they're over here. Hey, y'all. Okay, Gavin should get to know Adam. And you come in my house and mess my stuff up. Eve, if you don't. And she's just, she doesn't care. She's like, this is not my house. I don't have to discipline my own children in my daughter's house. Wow. <laughs> He's pretty good at that. <laughs> I have played um played the Sims and like kept doing generation and generation and generation. It was just weird that some of the siblings like they didn't know each other. It wasn't weird, but it was just like I would rather them know who their siblings are and everything like that. So I think I might do that. Keep them in touch with everybody. Cause this is cute. Okay y'all, it's about it's about time that y'all leave. Send home, send home. It was lovely having y'all over. But uh, me, Gavin have plans to plan a wedding. Chilo Penive Baima. So we're gonna plan a wedding. So yes, we're getting married. Um, do I want it to be a gold event? Gold event? I don't want to like if we don't do things well. I don't want to have a silver wedding. Okay, just for right now, because that's not important. Let's not make it goal oriented. We have the bride and groom, which is Gavin. Yeah. Okay, let's invite all these people. We don't need. <laughs> no, actually, let's invite him out. Just because, just because I was trying to talk to you, I was trying to be with you, but you didn't, you didn't, you didn't care. So we're just gonna invite you in. Have somebody character, hide that role. Mixologist, we're gonna hide that role. And a musician, hide that role. Machuno Meadows. Okay, so that's definitely where the wedding is going to be at. So we just spent that amount of money. Okay, so the wedding is. The wedding is now officially planned. Gavin, I don't understand why you don't sleep in this bed. No, go to sleep in this bed in here. Okay, so it's gonna not it's not gonna be a lot of people there, but um the people that are here, thank you for supporting us. <laughs> thank you for supporting us, and we're gonna go ahead and walk Ooh. over here. So this is the area where Gavin and Leah are supposed to get married. So go here. Okay, so get married to Gavin. Just a crowd. I'm 
Okay, I'm probably supposed to be talking, I'm just watching. Wow. So it was a nice wedding moment. So I'm gonna have him come in here and so just doing the wedding thing. So we have our piano player down here. Okay, Seri, stop! Please stop playing that. This is oh, yeah, the Seri, I was right. Jongi, Zub. So the wedding's okay. So we had a pretty good wedding. I'm probably just gonna go ahead and end it early. Okay, so now that the wedding and everything is over, and we finally we end this early. Now that the wedding is over, um, we're going to go ahead and move on to our third goal, and that's getting Leah pregnant. This episode is very long. I'm going to try to shorten it the best I can, but uh, we're going to have Leah and Gavin try for a baby now that they're married and everything. It's pretty cool. Okay, so we'll go ahead and let them do that and I'll speed it up. And it says break out the candles, make it romantic. Gavin and Leah are woohooing for the first time. They waited until marriage. So I'm gonna have her come in here and take a pregnancy test. Actually, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait to, sh to, take, to have her take a pregnancy ah. test. Only because if she doesn't, if she's not pregnant, she's going to be sad and then is going to ruin her chances of trying to get pregnant later. Not later, but I want her to get pregnant right now. So it's going to ruin her chances of them woohooing because she's going to be sad. So I'm going to wait. Okay, so they just got done woohooing. So I'm going to go have her, nope, not used gonna have her take a pregnancy test and she's finna throw up so I already know I already know she's pregnant I mean I don't have to wait for all the but we can oh, yes <laughs> I kind of already knew she was finna throw up yeah. it says congratulations <laughs> Leah is expecting there's going to be a new addition to this household so I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode there we finished all of our goals. We got Leah a new job. We got her a new man and got her married. And she is now pregnant. Although we didn't have the baby because that was the actual goal. Her being pregnant is just, that's perfect. That's fine. If you guys liked the video, go ahead and like it. And please subscribe. That'll do me wonders. Please comment down below your favorite part of the video. Mine, I think, was the wedding. It was cute. So um, thank you guys for watching. Shalom. Yeah, you give me